Vesper. And this could be coming to multiplayer in the near future within two to four months before World War II comes out. Just saying. So let's take a peek at this camo. It's actually pretty sexy. I, I enjoy it. it. Looks really good. Win a free copy of Call of Duty World War II. Yeah! All you have to do is like this video and subscribe right now to Trinity GX to enter my huge giveaway. The secret to winning my giveaways is to turn on notifications. What's going on TGX Squad? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be going over the brand new leak of the new weapons and camos coming to Black Ops 3 in the next 7 days. Really quick, if you guys are new, make sure you slap that subscribe button and of course, turn on notifications. Trinity GX will be entering phase 2 very soon and you're not going to want to miss all surprises I have in store for you. Myself yourself everybody in the black ops 3 community have many questions where are the new weapons where are the new camels it's been over a month the xmc was released a very long time ago and i have the same questions with that being said guys why not this week why didn't the weapons come out this week or last week why 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 well, I have the answer for you, Trinity GX Squad, tonight. One week ago, the reason why the weapons did not come out last week was because Call of Duty World War II released their campaign details within a five-day span. Now, if you guys don't know, Call of Duty tried this back in the past where they released multiple content for multiple Call of Duties, but it miserably failed. Now the biggest question, why didn't the weapons release this week? A lot of YouTubers claim that new weapons and camels would come this week, but of course we are wrong. And this new leak provides more details from a Treyarch leak of the new weapons. This week, for those who are curious why weapons did not come out, as you guys can see, Infinite Warfare released their new weapon batch, even though I don't think it really matters because, well, it's more MV4 Fallout Warfare, so anyways. <laughs> really quick, back in March, myself, Trinity GX, predicted majority of the weapons that would come and how Treyarch would approach releasing new weapons in Black Ops 3. we're looking at check it out here we go TGX squad here are the other three camels pack a punch camo I should say in Goro Crow we have this blue camo on the Vesper and this could be coming to multiplayer in the near future within two to four months before World War II comes out just saying so let's take a peek at this camo it's actually pretty sexy I, I enjoy it looks really good light baby blue color we're just going to fight from the hip a little bit. Next we got the purple. We got the purple camo. There we go. A little trap here in this corner over here. There we go. Out of the corner, baby. There we go. And now we got the green camo on the gate A7. There we go. The green camo I, I don't think is cool, but let me know in the comments below. What what camo do you guys think is awesome? All these camos look great. We're gonna switch. Bro, this Vesper just melts. I just want to point that out. His Vesper just melts. 
Let me know in the comments what camo you think is great out of all these camos you've seen in Revelations and Gord Crow V. All these camos possibly might be coming to Black Ops 3 very, very soon. doing is they're going from zombie chronicles to multiplayer multiplayer back to zombie chronicles due to the manpower needed for call of duty 2018 aka rumors has it it's going to be black ops 4 but please don't quote me on that because i have no idea what's coming out in 2018 from treyarch with that being said new weapons will come from zombie chronicles in the first the second week of october so expect new weapons either this coming up tuesday or the following tuesday that being said, it's something very, very special. It's going to be the last weapon batch before Call of Duty World War II takes off. And it's going to be a banger. So remember that. With that being said, the new limited edition camo will be the Blue Dragon Fire camo from Gord Crovey. Now, I predicted this on Sunday because, well, I'm very good at predicting things and what they do when it comes to swapping out content from zombies to multiplayer and vice versa. That being said, let's get straight into the new weapons, guys. In Black Ops 3 multiplayer, we can either, to figure this out, all we have to do is go to Zombie Chronicles and figure out what weapons are in Zombie Chronicles that are not in multiplayer. And like I came up with four weapons. We have the SGG-44, we have the Thompson, and we have the Type 99, aka the Bootlegger in Zombie Chronicles. Now that's just three. If you guys don't know, there is the MG42 LMG slot. There is the MG42 for the LMG slot of multiplayer. That weapon is located in Gort Crombie by the Pack-A-Punch machine. We're able to guard the building with the MG42 for some points and you get about 20 seconds of ammo. With that being said, guys, there's also another weapon you guys don't a lot of people don't know about this stuff it is a melee weapon now Treyarch has not released a melee weapon in over six months but the sickle just might return to black ops 3 multiplayer come next week or the week after Now this official leak comes from a Treyarch official who, who actually predicted the XMC. Well he really didn't predict it because he's the one that sits there at the table and leaks stuff <laughs> according to our sources. With that being said he pretty much predicted the MSMC to come to Black Ops 3 and then of course two days later the XMC was released from the last weapon batch. Now keep that in mind so this leak is actually pretty pretty solid we will definitely find out in the next couple days. With that being said, TGX Squad in the comments below, what weapons do you guys want to see in Black Ops 3? Honestly, from my personal opinion, all I want to see is the MG42. I could care less about the 44, the Thompson, or the Type 99. I don't care. I want the MG42 in the sickle. It's that simple. But TGX Squad, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Greatness redefined.